Francis O'Keefe from Go Guitar Lessons here. Today we're doing a John Mayer song called Belief. I love this song because it has a great mixture of his pop element and then his blues element uh, all into one. Now, it also is using a technique that we talked about a few weeks back called sixths. So the song is full of six harmonies. Uh, it sounds great. It's a little difficult and challenging uh, in a couple areas on the guitar. So it's a great song to learn uh, to improve your skills. There's a really cool solo. We're gonna break it down note for note. Let's do it right now. All right, here's a breakdown for belief. It's in the key of D minor. So we're gonna start here on the 10th fret, low E string, we're gonna hit that twice. We're then gonna, then gonna take our ring finger, we're gonna slide from 10 on the A string to 12. We get there, we're gonna hit on the G string, 10 with our index finger. And we're gonna go back to 12 on the A string and then back to 10 on the G string. We're gonna do a delayed non-picked slide. And then we're gonna pick again. So just to show you a recap, it looks like this. And that's our first riff. We're gonna go down here to the third fret low E string and we're gonna hit that twice. We're gonna slide from five to eight. Now it doesn't really matter where you slide from uh, for this part, you can slide from seven to eight. Uh, but since we're already here, we'll just slide. We'll do an instant slide. We would make sure we don't hear that five. So we slide to eight on the A string. Use our middle finger for the G string seven. Go back to eight on the A string. Go back to seven on the G string. Do a delayed non-pick slide to five. And then we pick five one more time. So here's what it looks like again, slowed down. The next one is the third fret A string. We're gonna hit it with actually our ring finger. Hit it twice, and then we're gonna slide from three to five on the A string with our ring finger, and then we're gonna hit three on the G string, back to five on the A string, back to three on the G string, do a delayed slide, and then pick it again. So that one should look like this. The last one, we go back up to D minor again. Hit the, the 10th fret low E string twice. We're gonna slide from 10 to 12 on the A string, just like we did the first time. Hit the G string 10, back to the A string 12, back to the G string 10. We do a delayed slide, but this time it's up to 12 and then hit it again. So it looks like. This is our verse section and intro of the song. So if I put those parts together, this is what it looks like. So we're just gonna keep repeating that for the verse, intro, and uh, a few other parts of the song too as well. Let's go to the chorus. We're gonna start here on the third fret low E string. Hit it twice. And then what we have to do is we're gonna slide up to 12, from 10 to 12 with our ring finger on the D string, and then we're gonna put our middle finger on the B string 11. Back to 12 on the D string, back to 11 on the B string, do a delayed slide, down to 10 and pick it. We're gonna hit the third fret A string twice. We're gonna slide from the D string eight to 10 with our middle finger and then our ring finger is gonna hit the 10th fret B string. Do a delayed slide down to eight and pick it again. We're then gonna put our index finger on one on the low E string and hit it twice. 
we're going to slide from the D string 7 to 8. And then our ring finger is going to go to 8 on the B string. Do a delayed slide down to 6 and then pick it. And the last one is on the first fret, A string. We're going to slide from the 5th fret D string to the 7th fret D string with our middle finger. And then our index finger is going to hit 6 on the B string. Delayed slide down to 5. So to show you that again, this is what it should look like. And then it's going to re repeat from there. Now for the chorus, there's some random guitar parts that sound like this. The actual chords that are happening here are D minor, G minor, G minor again, C major. And then we have a solo that happens uh, with the slide guitar. We go back, during that part, we go back to the intro. And then we have the actual guitar solo um, of the song. I'm gonna break down the guitar solo in this song tomorrow. So you should see it tomorrow or the day after. Uh, it's a great solo in the key of D minor and it has a good blues uh, feel and a lot of blues techniques to it. Uh, and, and it's definitely totally a John Mayer solo. Now, if you do like what you saw today, please subscribe to the channel. I am always doing videos. I always try and include tabs whenever I can. Uh, I'm always raising the quality and I'm always looking for feedback. So let me know what you guys want to see on the channel. You guys have any questions about theory, songs, whatever, it doesn't matter. Let me know.